Somebody listen to me in the house of God. I expected that when pastor was leading us through a moment of prayer on favor, I expected that someone would take it personal and you do it irrespective of who is hearing you, irrespective of the current circumstances. When we are talking about favor, we are talking about something that cannot be interpreted, understood, measured, rated, graded, compared, or contrasted among other factors as education will do. Somebody just listen to me. When we are talking about favor, we are talking about the language of God. We are talking about the language of God. Favor is the language that God speaketh. Someone listen to me. I'm talking about this young man. Oyo kijana ambaya mekuwa mchafu wa nasa muwaji mutu ambaye is a representative of the devil himself on the face of the earth. Oyo kijana ameenda akanajisi mama mzee akitoka sokoni. Wakati alipo angalia kaona kuna uwezekano huyu mama akafijua siri ya kila nimefanya na nikaumizwa na wanakijiji aliamua kuficha evidence kwa kuchukua kisu na kaongeza huko huyu mama akakufa but in the very process wakati kijana anafikiria kwamba ameficha hiyo evidence kuna mtu katika sehemu ya matawi ama ya kamusitu hapo alikuwa na cover that particular activity na simu yake in the video mode all of a sudden a release on social media watu wakasema hapana today is today this man we are tired of him he has to be killed the court ruled out the judge was not in favor of him kwa sababu ni mtu ambaye alikuwa ameshikwa mara wakada wakada the police printed it out wakandika katika makaratasi waka hang out wakasema wanted either dead or alive at some certain fee kwa sababu hivyo watu wanajua wakikuua ni biashara wamefanya na serikali so you are dead you are dead is something for us to live for you are dead is an advantage for me nikikuua kuna faida nimetengeneza somebody begin to flow with me i'm talking about favor then it went about everybody got tired this family of the woman who had been killed got tired yule anachukua chembe anachukua yule anachukua mpini yule anachukua shoka yule anachukua panga warungu watu wakachukua vitu wakaenda wakashambulia ukijana wakaanza kumkata kata wanamkata na kimbia lakini wanamkata all of a sudden kijana kafika paali akaanguka akafaint akazima wakaona amekufa yani Mungu tu hakuruhusu uhai utoke ndani yake lakini ukweli ni kwamba yeye kuisha nguvu na kufaint was a humble way of telling you I surrender to your will wakaamua huyu mtu kwa vile tunamchukia hatutaki kuishi tukiona kaburi lake walienda wakaamua waenda walete uh, how do you call it ile taya ya gari na mafuta wakati wameendea hivyo vitu kuna nguvu fulani Nisikilize, nisikilize. Nguvu ni mapenzi ya Mungu. Kuna nguvu fulani iliingia ndani mwa kijana, aka revive tena, kisha tena akatoka mbio. This time wakaanza kumfata mara ya pili because the objective of the enemy, the Bible says, he comes to steal, to kill and to destroy. The mob justice had an agenda of the enemy and it had to be fulfilled. They wanted to kill him. Wakamchukua kama za kumfata mbio. But this time kijana akakimbia akaenda kuingia katika boma la mzee fulani. Mzee maskini. Mzee ambaye anakaa kwa single room tena ya round. Haina dirisha ni mlango peke yake. Akapata mzee kwa compound. Akapiga nduru akampia mzee, "Nisaidie. Mbona nikusaidie? Hawa wanataka kuniua." But he asked something. Mzee asked something. Why today want to kill you? 
that the young man was I raped and killed when you are asking for the favor that is what you should know there is God expectation of our role to play in his miracles Zacchaeus you have to play a role of climbing the tree but Myers come on he is passing but there is a role you have to play by calling out the woman with the flow of blood listen to me you are hiding into that place will not help you there is a role for you to play and say I have to break this law I have to break this culture I am going there there is a role for you to play in the miracles of God Mary and Martha if the favor has to come into the tomb of Lazarus there is a role for you to play what we call going seeking finding yes. getting serviced before you come to serve there is a role for you to play and the boy had to play his role and what was the role to say the truth say the truth and the truth shall set you free say the truth you may not know you may not know how it will come but once you say the truth freedom is launched in the realm of the spirit I'm sorry in a beautiful church of this kind we still have church leaders who are still struggling with the truth yes. truth in their marriages truth in their families truth at their workplace truth in the ministry I'm sorry whenever you find yourself struggling with the truth you are struggling with the Jesus for Jesus is the way the truth and the life stop struggling with the Jesus yes. if you have to attract favor towards your way learn to be truthful praise the Lord he said the truth I raped and killed it doesn't matter how shameful is this? Say it. Say it. Deliverance is launched by confession. For the Bible records and by the word of the confession. The heart believes. The mouth confesses. And so salvation comes in place. Haesi kuokoka Kwa muamini Ndiyo kwa amini nukuzuri Lakini lazima ukiri There is something that will never happen in your life Yes Till you develop the culture of confessing For upon the tank In the mouth of man I have deposited The power of life And death You speak And I shall establish man was shocked somehow and he was like my son my house is a single room I don't have even a bed under which I can hide you I am a poor man my house doesn't have even a, a window through which you can escape I am a poor man but anyway anyway there are times when anyway can become something Jesus cries out he says father I know that you hear me meaning I don't have to do this to prove because I already know that you hear me but so that they may believe anyway <laughs> praise the Lord and he said anyway let me try to to talk to the mob and see if they can understand that when he talked to the mob they refused to believe him they threatened him and they told him if you don't give us this young man we will kill you 
we will kill him and we will destroy your homes and fracture your name and your history he came back to the house now listen to me he came back to the house the old man and he told the young man young man I've talked to them but they have refused to listen to me but the young man interjected and he was like no old man do what you can do to save me something can be done yes believe me now something can be done something can be done Believe me again, something can be done. If I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me, yes. something can be, can be done. We have slept on an empty stomach and we have woken up also on the same, same history as of yesterday. But as long as we are in the new dawn, believe me, something can be done. Yes. Something can still be done. And he looked at the young man. And he said, young man, they can't listen to me. But all the same, in Kuomeva, Abai Mekatakato Mapanga, Abai Konadam, it is condemned, it is judged, it is sinful, it is in red. Give it to me and take my white shirt. Give me your red shirt. And let me give you, you my white shirt. And do me one favor. Number two, I repeat again. There is God's expectation of our role in his miracles. Give and it shall be given. That is a role you need to play. Blessed be the name of Jesus. Hey, blessed are the peacemakers. For they shall be called the children of God. That's a role for you to play. And husbands love your wives exactly as Christ has loved the church. That's a role for you to play. And wives submit under your husband. For by so doing you shall attract love. That's a role for you to play. God does not work with the foolish stuff. God works with the people who are taking the steps. A man dikwe about the lepers. Wame katazwa kuingia katika hekalu mana wanambiwa kwa vila mnyingi mena jisika. Ingingi ni wakoncho mkingia katika hekalu mutalitia na jisi. Ivo basi musingia katika hekalu. Ni atari sana hekalu kukukata. Na pia kule kwa madui kwa wanajeshi wa adui wanaogopa kuenda. A man watapuawa. Walakini Binkus menya maza. Yes. When I was a higher binkus menya maza. Yes. When I fikiria higher binkus menya maza. And wakafika pa ali wakasema it can't continue like this. Oh. When we go back to the temple, we are losing. When we go back to them, we are losing. We have nothing to lose. Hata tukakapa watatupata. What we should do is to take a step. A step. They are feeble, but they are steps. God does not worry about the capacity of the step. As long as it is a step, he says, I will come into order the steps of the feet of the righteous men and women. Yes. Yes. But it is a step. But it is a step. Chukua kahawa, chukua ndizi, chukua njugu, chukua simsim enda ito. For I am the Lord, and that he amplifies the steps. E bingu zika angali ya zika sema, hii atua wamefanya, wamechukua katika ujinka, lakini wametimiza mapenzi ya bingu. E kila mara unapotimiza mapenzi ya mungu, e bingu zina kuja kukubaka apu. They are feeble steps. Hard to do what the temple, what the religious leaders were not able to do. Praise the Lord. Another step for you to be able to attract the favor of God. He said, keep 
my shirt clean. That's what he called favor. When the old man put on the red shirt of the young man, when he came out, when he came out, the people looked at him and they killed him. They burned his body. After they had done that, the young man came out of the house. When they looked at him, they did see him as the one they wanted to kill. Because whatever that has a problem is not you. It's that clock. Yes. distanced from the miracles of God. fertilized in your life. Your character umevaa. Ndio inakonja maisha yako. Had you put it out? My goodness. Had you put it out? That fire would go out. That is what the devil is accusing you of. Nirudia tena vile nilivyosema hapa. Shetani hana chake. That's why lazima kuja sikiliza vile unaomba achukue revelation do I manifest like an angel of light to Kubeni Shetani akikuletea alternative answers uko confused ufikirie imetoka kwa Mungu Shetani hana chake angalia kwa Illuminati he's not taking recruiting anybody he's finding people who are talented highly gifted preachers who are operating on higher levels of the gift how on the world to anatafuta the devil ni mchanja hajui kumeke he has been denied the ability to produce ability to give birth ability to mentor ability to strategize hananga hiyo anategemea vitu tumelea hapa kanisani ndipo akuja viibe viue na pate kuviharibu how i pray for you that you understand the language of the favor favor is the language of god favor simply means god loving you without you ina maanisha mungu haitaji maoni yako apate kukusaidia na wengine ndipo mzaliwe kama watoto wa kiume baba yako na mama yako waliua mtoto wa mtu katika nyumba ya kwenu ndipo kapata kuzaliwa iko basi maisha unaishi ni ya kivuli maisha unaishi ni ya wenyewe maisha unaishi kuna damu inakuhukumu lakini mungu anasema in spite of what you are Did. I am coming down to bless you. I'm coming to make you extravagant. I'm coming to make you more dynamic. I'm releasing the spirit of excellence over your life. I'm calling you again that it is well and because of the language of the favor. Favor means God loving you without you. You don't qualify it. You don't deserve it. I love it. I love it. I love it. When he says, not for your sake, but for the sake of my servant Jacob, I'm going to give you the treasures of darkness and riches in sacred places. Not because you've asked of it, but so that you may know I am the Lord your God that has called you by your name. So that you may know I pray in the name of Jesus. Kuna watu watafunguliwa milango ya kazi juma hili. Ili tu wapate kujua kuna heri katika kutegemea Mungu. Ili na muona mtu ambaye amekuwa kitumaini ya Mungu kwa ajili ya mlango fulani wa finances. E kwa muda mrefu ile ombi alijapata kujibiwa. Lakini kwa sababu ya luka ya kibali, luka ya neema milango sasa inafunguka juma ili bwana kufungulia milango all that you had trusted god for and now they are beginning to download towards your place is so that they you may know i am the lord your god and that has called you by your name e kuna mtu baba mungu alipata kuahidi babu zako e baraka fulani lakini wakaanguka kutoka katika njia ya Mungu na kwa sababu ya hiyo wamezikwa pasipo ya kukutana na baraka lakini sikiliza vile maandiko yanavyosema linapompa Mungu katika mdomo wake haliwezi likamrejelea tena mpaka litimize mapenzi yake na sikia Mungu anasema kupata
kupitia katika Daudi is there somebody left in the house of Saul at that time may show him mercy and that I may show him favor and that I may show him grace e mtu ameachwa hapo hafanani kama mtu ambaye anapaswa ikukula katika meza ya mfalme lakini kwa sababu iliko imaahidi wa mababu na yachili apokea kipali kipali cha doa kipali cha mahusiano kipali cha kazi kipali cha mashamba kipali cha huduma uponyaji wa magonjwa ya damu kipali kazini e promotion inakuja promotion inakuja kipali kwa masomo katika jina la Yesu somebody open up your mouth and pray God for favor open up your mouth and pray God for favor There is a role for you to play. Open up your mouth and thank God for favor. Una esa pika magotu kataka. Una esa kala machini ukataka. Una esa kaino amekono tu kataka. Ela tini pisha kibali. Kuna wengine mliambiwa mmepitwa na wakati katika kuoleka. Ela tini unaona wanaume wa maana wanakucha chia yako. Ninaona wanawake wa maana wanakucha chia yako. E kwa sababu tuna isu sasa. E katika majira ya neema.
eyes that they invent in our area of weaknesses when the devil accuses us before the father Jesus the Christ of God steps in place on our behalf that is what Christ calls for stepping in place for you Lana zilizo juya maisha yako zimekonyima fursa mateso uliyofanya yamekonyima fursa lakini maandiko yanasema the spirit of the lord knows our weaknesses and he steps in place in a manner as of groaning in the spirit anaanza kukuombea mbele za baba e kuna wakati vitu vinavyokukula e sio vitu ambavyo vimevijua e bado havijafunuliwa kwako e kile ambacho umewasilisha mbele ya bwana e bacho tapokuwa ni moja wapo ya vitu vinakukula lakini kuna uadui mkubwa zaidi nyuma ya ukuta wa maisha yako e maandiko yanasema the spirit of the lord is ise umenyaga Yesu Yeah. 
Maisha haya ni mazito sana ni yone uru